Welcome to your daily guidance. Michael, whoa. <laughs> Jeez. Make a commitment. As the angel of courage and confidence, I call upon you to lend me your strength. Allow me to commit to myself, my life, and my divine purpose. Please clearly guide me so that I can fully open my heart to every experience. Somebody might be making a commitment today. Somebody might be being proposed to today because look at how he's on one knee. Okay, what else has a general message? This, the situation is already resolved, so don't worry about it. Um, I give any worries, cares, and concerns to you in exchange for true peace in all ways. Thank you for resolving this, whatever situation, in a divinely perfect way. Um, if you've been waiting to make a commitment to somebody, uh, but there have been some things in the way, maybe even an issue with a child, Mer. Um, it's getting resolved, or it is, or it's already resolved. This one, it's already resolved. So you can go ahead and make that commitment. Um, yeah. And if it doesn't have to do with a child, it just could be that you know, don't worry about whatever that is. And also, it, it feels like it could be issues that either of you feel like are in the way of a commitment. Um, it's getting resolved. You are flying high right now, which may threaten others, but don't descend because others will soon be inspired by your example. Somebody needed to hear that for some reason. I didn't, I didn't take it out because it was just like a little side note. Okay, a message for the masculines, please. Caution is warranted. Look deeper into the situation before proceeding. Okay, feminines. You have an important life purpose involving communications. Don't let insecurities hold you back. <laughs> I just felt, felt somebody go, oh, because you know that I'm talking about you. And yes, I am. Okay, so spirit, tell me more about what the masculines need to be cautious about. What do they need to be cautious about or look deeper into? Maybe some secrets coming to light um, and them feeling a little defensive about it. It's like don't jump to conclusions is what I'm feeling. Um, delve deeper into it and you will have victory. There is clarity to be had. Um, so just don't don't be defensive. Don't be defensive. Like sort it, sort it out. Look deeper into the situation. Ask more questions. Find out what's really going on. Really look at it before reacting. Don't, yeah, I just got, again, don't jump to conclusions. Feminines, is there a message, message for this? Um, okay, so maybe this is in regards to whatever you're going to be communicating about. It might be something that's been having you up at night. It might be having to do with work. Having justice in a particular situation, seeing signs and synchronicities. Uh, it might, I might involve, it might involve a career change. Yeah, a career change that involves you communicating, maybe about things that have kept people awake at night, things that people are fearing, and bringing justice to it. So um, maybe there is, you know, it's going to be different for everybody again, but you know, it might involve legal matters or it might involve contracts, or it might involve just making things right for people. So if there's a particular area where you feel like people are scared around you and you wanna bring justice to that situation, that's probably a part of your life work. Okay, I feel like grabbing the oh, okay. Okay, so it's like you guys are finally getting, the dust is settling after something happened, uh, some kind of thing that made you guys regret and you're getting a, a fresh new start. Um, and this, oh, whatever that was, that you, that's what's getting resolved, is the regret is getting dissolved, and you're making a commitment and having a new beginning to even the mother of your child um, or is going to be the mother of your child now that you have resolved that um, regret and sadness. If there isn't a child involved, then you're just going to have a brand new abundant beginning with this person that you have now resolved a conflict with. 
All right. Have yourselves a beautiful day. We'll talk to you tomorrow.